It is our final meditation of 2020. Can you believe it? I mean, oh, this year has been full of so much chaos and calm. It's been full of fear and love and gratitude. And maybe we're giving great gratitude for things that we might not have expected <laughs> that we were giving gratitude for clean air and food and time with our family and being healthy. I mean, these are truly foundational gratitudes that is what 2020 was all about. 2020 in numerology actually equals four, which is about foundation. And I would say that 2020 has certainly achieved what it has been trying to do and helping us all find this foundation within our life of strength and gratitude and love and peace. And underneath all the crazy, I think we can all find each of those things. So today, being that it's our very last meditation before the turn of the year, I thought it'd be great that we set intention for the gift of 2021. And so in our meditation, we're going to set an intention. Maybe you have a word already for your year, or if you don't, it can just be a feeling or an image. But we're gonna place that inside a box. And we're gonna do a fun little meditation with that gift that 2021 is going to bring to us and that we're going to intend that it is going to bring to us because ultimately you are the faucet to the energy either flowing to you or not flowing to you. And so I hope that you find this meditation incredibly empowering and powerful. So let's go ahead and close our eyes and bring your attention down to your pelvic floor, the base of your spine, your perineum. Just beginning to invite your thoughts and worries and fears just to begin to settle down like glitter or snow in a snow globe, inviting them to float down to your pelvic floor, the base of your spine, your perineum. And from your pelvic floor, seeing this beautiful tree root push down from that pelvic floor down into the center of the earth, clicking in and pulling taut. And then we give Mama Earth so much gratitude. Thank you, Mama Earth, for the sun and the moon and the stars and the mountains and the oceans and our food and our water. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So grateful. Thank you. And you can remain in this state of gratitude for as long as you like. When you're ready, you can then go ahead and flush down what does not serve you, what collected there in that pelvic floor, flushing that down into the center of the earth, allowing that to be transformed into strength, and preparation and readiness, power, wisdom. Thank you, Mama Earth, for transforming all of our woes. So grateful. And you can remain in that state for as long as you like and when you're ready. You can draw up from the center of the earth this beautiful hot molten lava up that root, filling in your pelvic floor, the base of your spine, your perineum, allowing this nourishment of this earth energy. You can imagine this beautiful soil with minerals and water just nourishing your pelvic floor, the base of your spine, your perineum. And then allowing your attention to fall wherever it feels that it would like to fall. You can see this gift, a wrapped gift. And inside that gift, you know, it is what you want to intend for 2021. Maybe it's a word, maybe it's a symbol, maybe it's just a feeling. Is it peace? Is it hope? Is it health? Is it love, confidence, patience, whatever that is? See that within this wrapped present. And we're gonna sit there and just stare at that present for just a moment with this anxious anticipation. Because it is the energy of this anxious anticipation that begins to create even more desire that helps us to manifest even more into our life. 
And so then you can begin to ever so gently and ever so slowly begin to unwrap that present. But I want you to feel, notice in your body where you might feel this anticipation of this present opening. Notice how that experience feels, where it is being felt. As you've ever so gently and ever so slowly begin to unwrap that present. Not only what you placed inside, but maybe it's transformed. And I wonder what it might have transformed into as you begin to open it and ultimately open your present. So you continue to unwrap that present. And as that is unwrapping, maybe even notice how you're unwrapping. Are you being careful? Are you tearing it open? What are you doing? Always are correct, but just notice. It might be telling a story for you. And then go ahead when you're ready, taking that top off of that box and looking inside. And what do you see? Do you see a symbol? Do you see a word? Do you feel something? And if you do, where in your body do you feel it? Notice what's happening here and welcoming this manifestation into 2021, allowing this to be a powerful intention and desire. It is in our desire that we bring manifestations into our life. We bring what we want into our life through our desire. And if it's a symbol, if it's a thing, be notice how that can be applied to your physical body. If it's a, an emotion or a feeling, maybe pick that word or feeling up and place it on your body wherever it feels right. Any of those things that might have been in that box, if it's a symbol, place it on your body. If it's a thing, place it on your body. Just follow your guidance where you feel that that should be applied to your body. And notice, does that place on your body correspond to maybe something that might have been going on in your life right now? With your health, with your emotions, Just taking all of that in and thanking 2021 for this amazing way to somatically on our body bring that intention into this next year. So take one more minute, one more second with that on your body. And then we're going to kind of role play and look into 2021 where there's a, a scenario that may apply to what you found in that box. And maybe the old story was playing in 2021. You can see that and now apply whatever it is that you found in that box to your body. And then see what happens to that scenario. Play that scenario out in a new and improved and better way using the strength of the energy of whatever was inside that box, you have the power to create a new life for you. Did the scene change when you applied what was in the box? Did you create something new, something more powerful, more empowered? I hope so. And you can remain in this state for as long as you like. When you're ready, you know that your 2021 gift is there forever and always. And you're gonna to get to be able to tap into that at any point in time. But if you're ready to come back, you bring your attention back down to your pelvic floor, the base of your spine, your perineum. I am safe, I am secure and protected. Seeing that beautiful root push down through that pelvic floor down into the center of the earth, clicking in and pulling taut. Seeing that beautiful earth energy rise up one more time that root filling in your pelvic floor, the base of your spine, your perineum. I am safe. I am secure. I'm protected. On two, beginning to rub your palms together. Three, massage your water might have fallen asleep. Four, taking a great big deep breath and stretch. And five, coming back awake, alert, and refreshed. Back to this moment now. I cannot encourage you enough to do this meditation every single day up until the new year and allow whatever is inside that box to penetrate on your body. Welcome it 
on your body. It's called a somatic healing and it allows us to bring the energy of whatever that intention is into our physical being and our physical life. And you have the power to shift and change your life. I cannot wait to hear in the comments down below what you found inside your boxes, how this was helpful. And if you found it helpful, thank you so much for sharing and subscribing, of course, but sharing with your friends so that they can start to begin to have an amazing 2021 and setting intention in 2021. And I cannot wait to see you next week. Love yourself enough to heal, heal yourself enough to thrive. Take care.